So if you tell a Jew that if he does not keep Shabbat, in the eyes of Hashem, he's considered 100% an idol worshiper. Same thing like the guy from India selling his hair. Same thing like the guy from China worshiping a statue. A Jew is not going to like to hear it. But it's true. That's what Allah says. That changes the price. That changes. Like, oh, you know what? I don't want to be an idol worshiper. If you tell a Jew, listen, by the way, if you continue wasting seed, all your dreams of being successful, you can throw them in the garbage. Where even if you end up making a million dollars, you just still cry. Why? Because you were supposed to make a billion. Whatever money you have was supposed to be a lot more. Where's our proof for that? Someone that watches their breed gets a reward from Shemaim to be the mefarnis, to be the person that gives sustenance to other people. How do we know this? In Parashat Shavua, we have the whole sipu with Yosef HaTzadik. Yosef HaTzadik had a big test in front of him where Eshet Potiphar, the wife of Potiphar, tried to seduce him. And Yosef HaTzadik overcame the test and did not allow it. Did not have to happen even though it meant him going to jail for 12 years. He didn't fall for the test. For that reason, he was rewarded becoming the king of Egypt, the viceroy of Egypt, that not only made him very wealthy, but made the entire world depend on him. The entire world had to come to him to ask for money, including his own family, including Yaakov Avinu. Why? Because he protected his breed one time. From there we learn that somebody that protects their breed is not just someone that ends up being successful themselves, but also somebody that other people end up depending on, which is something that any normal person would want, because that's obviously something that means you have significance in the world. You mean something. And that also is a reason why Hashem gives certain people a long life. Anyone that wants a long life should make sure that as many people as possible depend on him or her. Why? Because even if somebody deserves chas v'shalom to die, if he knows somebody that doesn't deserve to lose him, doesn't deserve to, to, to lose this, uh, this person, they could stay alive just because of the merit of somebody else. So the point is that when a person watches their breed, they become a helper for other people, and that also gives them a, you know, as a, another opening to have a longer life. Next question.